Warning, when you will your bootloader, then your data will be wiped, so first you should back up your important data, and then you can flash it. Hi guys, my name is Nixar, and you are watching Nixar KB channel. Today I will told you how to flash firmware or custom recovery in any Android without computer. Now we will flash Oxygen OS 15 on OnePlus device by OTG Cable. First, you will download Bugjigger application from Play Store and some other required files for your device, custom recovery, custom kernel, and firmware ROM. Now we will use this type cable, C to C type cable. This is easy to connect, but you can use this type of cable. Now I'm using C to C type cable. So please, like my videos and subscribe my YouTube channel and press bell icon to receive my every video notification on your device. You can see in bug jigger application, this is showing no device to connected. Now we will open settings and enable developer option to unlock bootloader and we will another device enable OTG cable connection as we use PC. Tape on build number six or seven, time to enable developer options. Enable OEM unlocking and USB debugging option because it's important to unlock bootloader and flash firmware via OTG. Now we will use firmware ROM zip, custom recovery and custom kernel. With kernel SU zip in my device, I will provide you a link in my video description. You can download easily because it's free and without ads. I have connected cable easily, but you can face this issue in your device. So please, if you have faced any issues, no device connected, then you should change cable side or enable OTG cable connection as you will use device as PC. Click on Reboot Bootloader and your device reboot automatically into bootloader. Here you can see the device is successfully reboot to the bootloader. Now click on Fastboot Shell icon and put CMD command. Now type command fastboot om unlock in small letters, not capital letters. I have already unlocked bootloader, but you can type this command to unlock bootloader. For example, I will put bootloader unlock command in LG device. You can see Click on Reboot Bootloader and put same command as we have used in OnePlus device like Fastboot OEM Unlock. Now the LG device is successfully or boot into the bootloader mode. As you can see, the bootloader unlock option appear on the phone screen. Then press volume down button to select unlock the bootloader and press power button to yes. But I will press volume up button to select the don't unlock the bootloader because this is example. Now we will flash custom recovery on the OnePlus device and put the CMD commands. If it has appeared in your device screen like allow bug Jager to access Android, then you should be click on Allow. Now we will type a Fastboot Flash Recovery put space and then click on this icon to select Custom Recovery like Orange Fox Recovery. After that, we will press this icon to continue flashing. Now we have successfully flashed recovery. 
we will put Command Fast Boot Reboot Recovery in small letters. After recovery, we will install Oxygen OS 15 ROM ZIP via Orange Fox Recovery. It may take longer, please don't be afraid. After Oxygen ROM, we will flash Custom Kernel Zip with Support Kernel SU, but you can choose any custom kernel for your Android device to boost your device and improve game performance. Here we can see Custom Kernel. I will flash on Android 15, but you can flash this kernel on Android 13 and Android 14. After successfully installed, now we will click on System Reboot. It may take longer, please don't be afraid. We have successfully installed Oxygen 15. Here we can see. Oxygen OS 15, much better in colors, menu icons, and some features as VoLTE, I liked. But everything not good, I have faced only one issue in this version. It has supported fast charging, but showing on screen. So this is a bug, not a fault. I agree, this is good in graphics and other features. Wow, here we can see this Android OS 15. Guys, we will flash Oxygen OS 15 ROM via OTA local update, but OTA local update is only working on Android 15. So I will get solution of this issue and I will upload a video soon about OTA local install. Here you can see I install local OTA update. It may take longer, please don't be afraid. After complete, I will click on Restart. The device will reboot to finish this process. Now the device is successfully updated on Android 15. Here you can see. Here you can see it's supporting VoLTE, and the other feature is active, but if I shall tell you, the video will be too long. Guys, don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Be happy and enjoy with Oxygen OS 15. Thanks for watching.